Okay, watching Revenge of the Sith. The, what? What are they? What are they doing? What? Were they, what? What were they doing? Were they just standing there waiting for the scene to start? <laughs> Does fucking Palpatine need to just walk circles around his office to keep his knees in good shape? Oh god. In McDermott, in all fairness, is is has mastered the dramatic pause in the middle of nothing happening. <laughs> Film is a visual medium, but have you ever written a dialogue scene only to realise nothing visual is going on? Here's an exercise to make your dialogue scenes cinematic. Take your scene and ask yourself, what is the emotional story here? It could be a shift in power between two people, a newfound respect, a dying romance. Write that scene again, from scratch, as a silent movie. Convey the story of that scene using only the visuals. Play with locations, props, everyday tasks. The weather. Find a visual metaphor to represent the changing drama. If you're struggling, your scene may not have a clear emotional dynamic, so now is the time to create one. You can also use this as an overlay to make expositional scenes genuinely engaging. And at the end of it all, if you want to put the dialogue back in, you can. But maybe you don't need all of it. Maybe you don't need it at all. One of, the, one of the last things that fell into place was how to manage the first act. We ended up with a number of scenes that were all laboring to accomplish certain requisite things, like who these characters are, who, who they are to each other, and stuff like that. I mean, there's a scene in the film when we meet Dave, uh, and you watch these two brothers warm up and work out and then something happens. But just the way that they warmed up with each other, you you know, you, you saw everything that these other scenes were laboring to do. I mean, wor wordlessly. Whoa, what the fuck are they doing? Were they wrestling over something? What the fuck were these people doing before the camera started rolling? Were they just like sitting in absolute silence for five minutes? Well, we've had standing and talking about the plot. Let's move to sitting and talking about the plot. <laughs> Natalie Portman's too good for this. Hayden Christensen? Well, I suppose we'll never know. <laughs> You're basically sitting here looking at things. And then the scene starts. Trust me, it'll look, it'll look good in the end. All that green, that's gonna be, gonna be glorious after we're done with it. 